what's up my golden flowers so this is like day seven we painted her room i actually have the color the paint color that this is just in case i'll link it down below as you can see if you guys stay tuned i'm gonna actually do everything in detail about this glitter wall Flights, more champagne different places do the same thing as you grow you see that things change and i know if i just help you maintain got this from michael's that's the name of it also, I got I wanted it to be some chunky glitter. I got this kind of holographic glitter. Then from Walmart, I got a whole bunch of this. It's fine. Extra fine. Also, what you need is um this mod podge. Make sure it's the gloss luster. It looks like um Elmer's glue, but it's it's kind of like Elmer's glue, but it's strong. So I got about I have five of these baby. A paintbrush, any order, any ordinary paintbrush. I like to get the ones with the angle. How you know that you have enough glitter is that um, your paste becomes real thick like pancake batter. Open up this one. And the last one, which is the ultra fine glitter. You guys see that? That is actually the consistency. So I think we're pretty much done. I'm taking the chunk pool and all I'm doing is brushing it upwards on the wall. Don't think that you can get a big paint roller and just scoop it on here and roll it on here because that is gonna collect a whole bunch of glitter. This is the easiest way, and again, take it from me because I have my paint roller right here and it was not working in my favor at all. I was losing glitter, some glitter was on, it was sticking to the paint roller, so yeah, no. It was just an epic fail. Okay, you guys, I also wanted to show you this part right here. This is a prime example right in this area and right in this area of the spotchy and patchy type of thing that you'll get once you're doing your glitter wall. Um, this is an overnight base wall, what I did last night, and this is actually what I did today. You can tell the difference of the color. This is wet, this is dry. Um, but as you can see how it dried, it had these little spatchy and patchy things right here, the areas. All you do is get some more of your concoction, dib dab it on, kind of brush on into the area until you don't see it no more and let it sit and dry, okay? And we're moving on. Hey you guys, so progression, I have completed this side up here and now I just need to edge all of that all this down here is dry as you can see all this is dry now for the patchy spots as you can see there is a few patchy spots it in person it honestly looks like a galaxy wall but I want it to be more solidary so I want it to look like this this wall this side of the wall um you can see i ran out of the glue over here so i was kind of spreading it heavy instead of laying it on thick but like i said if you wanted to leave it like this you definitely could because it literally looks like a galaxy wall compared to all the other rooms i mean all the other sides of the room but like I said, I'm gonna go in and patch everything kind of like I did over here. This is all wet, as you can see the difference of everything. But also when it dries, it looks so gorgeous, you guys. Oh my God.
champagne Different places do the same thing As you grow you see that things change A 9 to 5 just help you maintain